Good morning, everyone. My name is Sophia, and I'm pleased to present to you my journey in peer mediation. The goal of my project was to investigate the problem of exclusion amongst the cheer team here at OHS. I chose to focus on this issue because over the years, coaches would come and go, leaving cheerleaders without a role model. We weren't able to create a real connection with each other, and it was difficult to build a good relationship. According to my post-project survey, I discovered that over half of the members from both JV and varsity teams agreed or strongly agreed that exclusion was a serious problem. And to remedy this problem, during lunch, my partner and I passed out note cards and markers for cheerleaders to write a kind message to someone else on the opposing team. For example, if someone was on varsity, they had to write to someone on JV, and vice versa. We encouraged people to participate with the incentive that they would get candy and benefit next year's cheer team. Before I play these interviews, I feel that my project was successful in helping to remedy this problem at OHS because many of the girls offered solutions and new ways to solve the problem. They understood the importance of inclusiveness. And now back to the interviews. This experience was really fun. It made me feel really good about myself that I was able to give somebody a compliment and I hope it made their day. It felt really nice to get a letter from someone else and it just felt so thoughtful. It helped probably get better at understanding that we can do more team bonding activities and getting to know your activities so that we can work as a team. To solve this problem, we can better our communication skills. And we also need a good role model on the team that is very inclusive of everyone. Maybe like a captain, since I know that the coaches do not want a captain, and I feel having that leadership and having a kind and welcoming and inclusive leader is key to the team. After completing this project, I realized that as a peer mediator, I am now able to notice and solve problems that arise between the people around me. Even though it felt intimidating at first, I'm glad to know that more people are open to change than opposed to it. The assignment that was most helpful in improving the relationship I have with myself is nurturing my inner child. This assignment allowed me to reflect on my past and get into journaling. The skill that it helped me develop was gratitude because I thought about who I was in elementary, middle, and high school and how in each chapter of my life I have grown into a different version of myself. The assignment that was most helpful in improving my relationship with others is the TED Talk video, The Anatomy of Trust. Before the video, I was hesitant but really wanted to improve my relationship with my sister. The video helped me understand trust and what is missing in our relationship. I discovered that we needed to set boundaries and be able to depend on one another in order for us to connect again. The skill that it helped me develop was honesty because we had to be honest about what we both expected from each other. I had to find the right time to speak to her and overall put in more effort. In closing, I'd like to say thank you to Ms. Rodriguez and my classmates. Thank you all for making this class feel so comforting and safe. I wish everyone good luck in the future and life after graduating high school.